family and I were on a Saturday hike. I took a step and my foot went that way and my ankle went that way and I heard the crack and uh, I knew immediately that it was, it was not good. By the time we got to the hospital and they were able to reduce it, it had been over four hours um, so that the, the blood supply had been um, compromised to the talus. And they did surgery the next day, had a, a tibia, a fibula, and a talus break and they were able to, um, to repair the tibia and fibula and they weren't sure if the talus was going to make it. And sure enough, two years later, it, it, um, I started having significant issues. Um, I found out about the Foot and Ankle Institute and came here and they said I was a, a good candidate for the surgery. Iocartilage encompasses all of the specialized proteins and things that are naturally in cartilage, but it doesn't have any cells in it. And it's combined with cells from the patient, either from their peripheral blood or from their bone marrow. We do it during surgery. We mix the two together and then we can use it and manipulate it and work it and smooth it out to kind of get that nice smooth cartilage surface back by patching the hole. The main uh, technique or basis is arthroscopy with you know, miniature cameras and video equipment to look in the joints uh, to try to keep small incisions and minimally invasive because it makes it easier for the patient to heal. It's five years um, since, since this surgery, seven years since my initial injury. Um, three years ago, I did the Avon 39.3 mile walk um, for breast cancer, um, which had always been on my bucket list. And um, after my initial injury, I didn't think I would ever be able to accomplish that. 39.3 miles in two days. and. Um, I had absolutely no problems whatsoever from, from my ankle. If you have an injury, if you have a, something that's bothering you, find the best doctors out there. Um, I found them at Mercy Hospital. There's no need of living in pain if you can find the right doctors.